Family and friends hold a vigil tonight for a Sanger father who died in a hit and run accident. Family members say that 34 year old Daniel Barrera had two young children and another on the way when police say he was hit by a drunk driver last Sunday morning. CBS 47's Madaris Babb joins us live at the Fresno County Jail with more. Madaris. 24 year old Miguel Angel Escamilla is in custody here at the Fresno County Jail, and he faces several charges, including vehicular manslaughter, and his bail was set around $200,000. When speaking with Barrera's family tonight, they're paying tribute to the loving father they say was taken too soon. It's a young family that was just, you know, enjoying their life, uh, doing their own thing, and uh, they were going out hiking that morning, and uh, that's when the Drunk driver hit them. Friends and family members of 34 year old Daniel Barrera have come to this intersection every night since Sunday to light candles and pay their respects for the loving father. The nicest, quiet guy you will ever met. And he had that smile, even though he, he never talked. The one thing that we used to tell him is, Daniel, stop, man, let other people talk. He didn't talk for talk, he was all action. Police say Barrera and his eight year old son were driving near church in Sunnyside Avenues on Sunday around 6 a.m. when 24 year old Miguel Angel Escamilla ran a stop sign and crashed a BMW into them. Lieutenant Israel Reyes says Escamilla took off from the scene and was found just down the street banging on a neighbor's door. He was obviously intoxicated, uh, and by witness statement, very intoxicated. Barrera died, and the eight-year-old has minor injuries. Barrera's brother-in-law, Mauricio Gomez, says Barrera is survived by his pregnant fiance, son, and stepdaughter. Family members are asking the courts to grant justice. I don't think he will ever repay any of the damage that he has done, but at least he needs to pay the consequences of his actions. Barrera does not have a GoFundMe set up yet, but his family does plan to set up one to pay for the costs of the family. Once it is up, we will link that to our website, yourcentralvalley.com. Reporting live from downtown Fresno, Madaris Babb, CBS 47, Eyewitness News.